Hi, this is Andy Filippiuk in Toronto for the week of February the 18th. This past week we saw the Fed minutes, which indicated that the Fed's balance sheet roll-off may stop a lot sooner than expected and in fact may end before this year is out. Now this has resulted in a lot of criticism from the financial community and a lot of it justified as the Fed is grappling to understand what this all means. Ten years ago, Ben Bernanke was on 60 Minutes when he was asked about all the money printing that quantitative easing was to bring, he was quick to defend that this was not money printing and that it would be unwound at some point in the future. Well, we're 10 years down the road and now the Fed is finding out just how difficult it is to get out of a policy. Like Murphy's Law, it's easier to get into something than it is to get out. On CNBC this past week, I saw a Fed Governor Bullard talking about uh, this very issue, stating that they're now understanding that the reserves that they're pulling out, meaning the buying of bonds and extinguishing the cash, is being very hard on the economy as these reserves are necessary, which means the system is so heavily levered that they're terrified of pulling any good collateral, which treasury bonds are, out of the system. So we're going to have to just sit back and let the markets try to digest exactly what's happening. But this is not good because the people who are driving the economy, the central bank in the US, really is grappling as to what to do. We're at two and a half percent interest rates and the balance sheet winding or unwinding is now kind of stagnant going forward. So next week I'll be talking about how corporations in Canada are taking advantage of financing opportunities as a result of all this mispricing in the financial markets. Thanks for watching.